Hello everyone, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can clone any website and how we can host that cloned website to this live server. So I'm going to show you a step by step. So here we go. So first of all, we need to find a website, which website you want to clone. So I'm going to open that website TCB new demo. And as you can see, this website have a multiple pages like home, menu, about, book table. Okay. Now I'm going to clone all these pages. So first of all, open the terminal. Okay on your laptop and first check wget is installed on your laptop or not okay so wget just search here and as you can see here wget missing url it means wget is installed if wget is not installed on your laptop or system then just search your wget for windows or you can download it macbook have a default wget okay now now here what we need to do here just type here wget da double dash and mirror space double dash convert single dash link double dash weight equal to space you need to paste your website url here and just copy that website url okay and just paste it here okay i'm gonna just remove the index the main website url and just enter okay and once you've done this that will download all your website pages okay so let's wait some second as you can see we have run that command in the macbook here it means in the home directory you can you can shift your directory to cd home or cd desktop or cd document anywhere and then you can run that command so i've run that command in the home directory so let's go to the home directory here so as you can see tcb new demo folder is created just open that and as you can see all these file is here now let's open that index.html and as you can see this website is in our local host you can see your local host url you can redirect to the menu we have used convert link parameter also so that will convert all your link to the local host as you can see about us book table all the pages we have we have clone our website now i want to need some changes on that website and i'm going to host that website in the live server okay so first of all open as you can see this is the folder we have okay so i'm going to open that folder in vs code so open the VS code, click on file, click on open folder, TCB new demo website, just open it. Now as you can see here, we have the about.html, index.html. Now what we need to do here, go to the home like there. And as you can see here, this is the fast food restaurant, okay. So just copy that, go here and just search here. Use command F for control app and just search. This is as you can see here, three times, okay. So I'm going to just replace this to TCB cafe okay and just replace all like this if you want to find that in the all these pages like four pages or five pages so use the command shift f or control shift f and search it as you can see there is nothing like this okay okay I'll just save it tcv cafe that's really good now i'm going to just try the about as you can see here, we are here now as you can see they have a footer okay there were details like contact number email that okay so i'm going to just copy that email here okay and just find here how many times is there is four pages that are the same details okay so i'm going to just click on this arrow and replace all these emails from my own email tcb tcb at gmail.com and just click on here to replace for all pages then now let me just refresh this and go home yes you see tcb at gmail.com so we have replaced the content okay in clone website now this is our folder Okay, as you can see, this is our folder. Now I need to host that website. So for that, we need to buy any hosting. So I'll give you the link of hostinger in the description. So you will get 20% off. Okay, so after purchasing the hosting, you need to go to the file manager. You can use any hosting. Okay, but make sure whenever you log into your hosting, you need to go to the file manager of your hosting. Okay, file manager. Under that file manager, you will have the public underscore HTML folder. Open this. And as you can see, you will get some files or will not get some files. So I'm going to delete that file under the public HTML folder. Like delete this. And now I'm going to upload my whole folder files here. Okay. So how we can do this? So just go here. Open that folder. And we need to upload all these folder and file both. Okay. So select all these files. Okay. Select all these files. And just zip that file. Compress. Like we have a zip file. Now I'm going to upload that zip file, okay? So just drag and drop that zip file here, okay? And wait some seconds and it's done, okay? Now, let me just unzip that file now. Now right click on that zip file and as you can see the extract option, click on extract 
and they are asking for the new folder so you can just type your new folder we don't require that but i need to do this because there is no other option for that so i'm going to just select a new and just click on extract okay so we have the new folder and that in new folder as you can see here we have all the files okay now i'm going to select that file and i'm going to select all the files here okay like this and just we need to move that as you can see there's a move option click on move file and we need to move all these files to the public html okay so double click and double click here and it is the new folder so we need we don't need to go to the under the new folder just paste it here move public html folder go here just home so under the public html folder we have all the files so make sure we have index file yes now let's open this tcb new.xyz and amazing as you can see tcb cafe this is our live website cool and as you can see this all will redirect to the other pages fantastic so this is how you can clone any website and how you can host the website if you have any doubt you can ask me in comment thank you so much for watching this video have a nice day be safe bye bye